Hi everyone and welcome to a new episode of the Wolves FIFA 21 career mode. We had a bit of a disappointing month last time out and suffered our first league defeat. Well it was more of a thrashing as we were hammered 3 ones at the hands of Crystal Palace. We also suffered a major injury bro with Jao Moutinho being injured and out for the next 7 months. Before we get into the episode don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notification button so you don't miss any out on any future content from the channel. It's also a massive help to the channel and I'm so grateful for all the support we've had so far. So let's get into the episode. We have four fixtures this month. We start off with a home game against newly promoted Leeds. We then take a trip to Everton. We take a break for cup action as we try to get revenge on Crystal Palace for the defeat in the league. And then we finish the month off with a home game against the current champions, Liverpool. Up first is the home game against Leeds United. Here is the lineup for Wolves today. We have changed Sace's position to a central midfielder. So he'll be partnering Neves in midfield, otherwise it's an unchanged team. Here is the Leeds team lineup for today's game. Leeds currently sitting at the bottom of the table, but they definitely won't be a pushover. This could be a tough game. Semedo plays Adama into space and he's away. He gets into the box and lofts the ball to Jimenez and he heads wide. That was an excellent chance. Should have been 1-0. Jimenez plays the ball out wide to Johnny. He whips in a delightful cross and Neves is there to head it home. That was just the start we needed. That's Neves' third goal of the season. Leeds are on the attack, they play the ball round nicely, they manage to get the ball into the box and it finds Harrison and his shot is saved by Patricio. Neves lifts the ball out wide to Neto, he runs forward and puts the ball towards the far post and there's Adama to smash it home to make it 2-0. Adama is on fire at the moment. Neves runs forward with the ball and bursts into the box. He puts in a cross but it goes over Jimenez. He manages to retrieve the ball and he crosses it back in and it's headed over by Neves. Sage plays the ball out wide to Adama. He plays it square to Neves who feeds Jimenez. His shot is pushed past the post by the keeper. Leeds play the ball forward. Rodrigo plays a ball that splits the Wolves defence and Bentaleb is there to slot it home. Again, our defensive frailties have been shown and Leeds are now back in this game. 2-1. So at the break, it's Wolves 2, Leeds United 1. Neves feeds the ball to Podence. He plays it to Silva, who plays it to Neves. His shot is pushed wide by the keeper. Cody finds Neves. He spots the run of Podence and he chips the ball in and there's Silva to smash it home for Wolves. Have we unleashed a potential star in Silver? That surely seals it for Wolves now. So it's finished here today. Wolves 3, Leeds United 1. So here we are today at Goodison Park as we take on Everton in today's game. Here is the Everton lineup for today's game. They're a strong outfit now, Everton, especially after the signings they made in the recent transfer window. This is going to be a tough game. Here is the Wolves lineup for today's game. It's an unchanged side that managed to defeat Leeds in the last game. Will Rowan and Jimenez manage to get on the score sheet this time and stop his barren run? Neves plays the ball forward to Jimenez 
His control is good and plays in Sace. He smashes the ball home to make it 1-0. I think Sace is enjoying his new position as a central midfielder. The ball is played to Rodriguez in the box. His shot is pushed wide by Patricio. That was a good chance for Everton. At the break, it's Everton 0, Wolves 1. Delft plays the ball forward and finds Sakuri. He gets past the Kumpakano and backheels the ball to Calvert-Lewin, who puts the ball into the bottom corner of the net. 1-1. Game on here now at Goodison Park. Neves spots the run of Neto out on the wing and he's through on goal. He gets into the box and blasts his shot past a helpless Pickford to make it 2-1. That was a fantastic counter-attack from the boys there. The ball is played to Neto. He plays it forward and finds Silva. Silva turns the defender and is on goal. He makes it 3-1. Another fantastic finish from Fabio Silva. Maybe he might have to start up front instead of Jimenez in the next game. Everton have the ball at the back. Neves manages to intercept the ball and his shot is saved by Pickford. So it's finished here today. Everton 1, Wolverhampton Wanderers 3. Up next is EFL Cup action as we try to get revenge on Crystal Palace. We have changed the team up a little for this game. Silver's starting up front for Wolves. Palace lead 1-0 at half time thanks to a goal from Ayu. So we have slipped to yet another defeat at the hands of Crystal Palace and this one has also led to an exit from the EFL Cup. Hopefully now we now can concentrate on the league and the FA Cup moving forwards. Molyneux is packed to the rafters as we welcome Liverpool for today's game. Tanoli is back in the midfield to partner Neves. Otherwise it's an unchanged team from the victory over Everton in the last game. Can we make it another win in the league? Here is the Liverpool lineup for today's game. This is a very strong Liverpool side. It's going to be a difficult game. We may need to make the home advantage count. Hopefully the fans will get behind us. Kaita has the ball and moves forward and feeds Firmino. He gets the ball past Upper Mancano and fires the ball into the net to make it 1-0. Not the start we were looking for. Again, it's been poor from Wolves at the back. We really need to tighten up this defending, otherwise we're not going to get anywhere. Henderson finds Kaita. He then finds Salah. His quick pass finds Firmino and he feeds Salah back in and his shot is saved by Patricio. We're into the second half. Robertson has the ball. He plays it to Wijnaldum and he skips past Connor Cody and his shot is pushed away by Patricio. Cater picks the ball back up again but unfortunately he's offside. That was a let off again. Johnny plays the ball to Neto in space on the wing. He's in on goal. He just needs to stay composed but unfortunately his shot is superly saved by an outstretched hand from Allison. That was a great chance. Neto has the ball out wide. He manages out muscle Alexander Arnold and his ball finds Adama at the far post, but unfortunately heads wide. Firmino finds Wijnaldum. He holds off the defender and plays a lovely through ball back to Firmino and he somehow manages to put his shot wide. The ball is played to Adama in space on the wing. He bursts into the box and pulls the ball back to Jimenez, but the Liverpool defence managed to block the shot. Podens finds Neves. He plays the ball to Ferreira and his shot is saved by Allison. That was the chance to draw level. Well we certainly gave Liverpool a game here today. We cannot get downhearted from this defeat as it was a good performance from the boys. We will take the positives and move forward on to the next game. It's ended here today. Wolves nil, Liverpool won. So I think we can say that October was a good month in all. Two league wins out of the three games. 
The defeat against Liverpool was a close run match and I'm sure it will help build the confidence to the squad moving forwards. Thankfully, no more injuries this month, so things are looking good. We're currently sitting 7th, only 3 points off the Champions League spots. I do think we might have to have a look at giving Fabio a silver a run up out up front, especially if Jimenez carries on this barren run of form in front of goal. What do you guys think? Shall we give him a try? Drop a comment down below on any suggestions of what to do. Until next time, take it easy and goodbye.